In this video, I'll be showing you how to make a carbon fibre roof. Stay tuned. Hello YouTube, welcome back to the channel. Uh, this video is going to be about making a carbon fibre roof for a Fiesta Mark 1 or a Mark 2. They're, they're both the same roof. Um, out of uh, carbon fibre with a core material um, through the process of resin infusion. Uh, this is a mould that I've been, uh, I've made this mould a good few years ago now with my own car. So, because uh, it's going to be a part that's going to be fitted to the outside of the uh, building, the exterior of the car, uh, we're going to have to put a, a UV protective gel coat on this. So the first job is to use uh, a two millimetre spray nozzle uh, uh, gravity fed gun and spray a nice uh, even layer of gel coat over uh, the inside surface of the mould. It's already been pre-released uh, so it's got plenty of release agent on it. So we just need to get a nice coating of gel coat on it, let that go off and then we can uh, carry on with the layer. So let's start with the gel coat. Okay, so that's the uh, layer of gel coat down. So we've got a nice even coverage now. And that's gonna give us a nice UV protection uh, from the sunlight, which will stop the resin from deteriorating and uh, go to a horrible yellow color. You see a lot of carbon fiber parts that are exposed to the sun go. So this is gonna be the, uh, the protective layer. So just gotta leave that now for 24 hours, um, just till it goes nice and um, nice and dry to the touch. Then we can start laying up the fabric and um, and start with the infusion. So uh, let's let it cure. Okay, so now the gel coat's fully cured. It's dry and uh, dry to the touch. There's no tackiness at all to it. So it's uh, ready to start laying up the stack. Um, I'll be using a combination of uh, two by two twill and a uh, four by four twill. Uh, that's a 200 gram, that's a 400 gram. Uh, the heavier weight just saves using multiple layers of thinner grade, if you like, just a, a quicker way of laying up uh, strength in the, uh, the stack. Then, because we'll be doing some secondary bonding on this roof, just got to be bonded to part of the existing roof, we'll be putting a peel ply, which is this uh, material. We'll be putting that onto the back of the uh, the laminate. And then I'll be using a um, an infusion mesh, which is this stuff. Then the usual gels on with the vacuum bag, get it sealed up, vacuum test it and start infusing it. So I'm going to take care of doing the uh, the first layer, uh, which I'm going to put on now, because that's, that's the bit you're going to see. So that's it's, in, it's so important to get the uh, the weave as neat as possible, because that's the first thing people look at. I mean, the majority of people who walk around shows or track days and they look at carbon fibre parts, they're not really bothered about how strong they are when they look at someone else's cars. Like, right, how neat is the weave? So the first layer is really important. So you've just got to take your time and just make sure it's laid down nice and neat. Because once, once that layer's down, you can just you can bang the rest of the carbon on. It's that first layer that's important. So that's why I'll be taking my time on the first layer. But yeah, so let's start laying up the stack.
Right, so that was a stressful bit done now. It's been laid, um, first layer's been laid down really nice and neat. The weave's perfect. Got a lovely, nice diagonal direction there. There's no waves or uh, change in direction, which is exactly what you want. So now we're gonna start, well, now I'm gonna start laying up the rest of the stack. Um, if you look closely, when, I, when I'm laying it up, I'll be rotating the weave on a 45, just making it upside down. It just means you're gonna get the most strength out of the laminate when it's, uh, when it's infused. So like, like one weave will go that way, then the next layer will go that way. It just gets as much strength as you can out of it. But um, yeah, just to finish the stack off now, let's get it laid up. You held me back when I tried to move on from your life So you stole my life for clarity So hold me back, now you're here Cause I'm mad, show no fear Wanna let you know just how it felt That you call up when you're down Wanna be the first who knows all of your deepest secrets Can I be the one who wakes you up before you miss your ride? Cause I wanna be close to you And I wanna show you something new You gotta know Every day I got your back Yeah, you can count on me for that so put your hand in mine, I will be there every day When you're sick of the climb, I will make sure it's okay I know you didn't ask for any of this But we beat for the sky, cause we're flying colors now
something new you gotta know every day i got your back yeah you can count on me yeah. so put your hand in mine i will be there every day when you're sick of the climb i will make sure it's okay So I've done a leak down test and uh, there's no moons on the vacuum. So um, I've mixed up a batch of resin, so it's time to uh, get some, some resin infused. Hopefully it'll go, uh, go to plan. So let's get going.
Okay, so that's it, all done. Just trimmed it all up now with the uh, the angle cutter, uh, giving it a bit of a polish, and then um, that's the end result. That's super light, really is light and mega mega strong. Got a nice lovely finish there, glossy uh, glossy mirror finish. But uh, that's how you do it. That's how you make a carbon fibre roof. So I uh, hope you enjoyed the video. If you have, please uh, like, share, and subscribe. And um, on to the next job and on to the next video. So I'll see you soon. Cheers.